Morning, Mr. Badish. Good morning. Uh, I'd like to examine your neck today, if that's okay. Yep, that's fine. Do you have any pain at all? No. If there's any discomfort or pain uh, whilst we're doing the examination, let me know and then we can stop. Okay. All right. So first I'm going to have a look from the front and the sides. Uh, would you like to just undo the top button there for me? Thank you. When examining a patient's neck, ensure adequate exposure. Inspect from the front and side to look for abnormalities such as scars, lumps and skin changes. Next, I'm going to uh, palpate the neck and I'm going to be standing from behind you. Always palpate standing behind the patient and ensure you feel all contents of the anterior and posterior triangles of the neck. It is advisable to feel one side at a time. Start by feeling the midline structures of the anterior neck and then all the other lymph node areas of the neck. Including the submental, submandibular, anterior chain, supraclavicular, posterior chain, occipital, postauricular, and preauricular lymph nodes. If you are able to see or feel a midline lump, perform the following manoeuvres to assess whether this may be related to the thyroid gland or a thyroglossal cyst. Would you mind um, taking some water into the mouth and just holding it there for me? Lift your chin up slightly um, and if you swallow for me, good. Uh, and if you open your mouth and stick your tongue out, um, back in. Thank you very much. Okay, would you mind just um, holding this water? Now if you take a sip and hold the water in your mouth, and don't swallow it just yet. Now if you can swallow the water for me, good. Next, if you can open your mouth as wide as you can go, and then stick your tongue out for me, and then back in, and out again, and back in again. Thank you.